What happens when a disillusioned lawyer decides to chase his dessert-loving dreams? He quits his job, goes to pastry school, opens a wildly popular dessert truck, and parlays that success into his own New York City restaurant. And now Chef Jerome Chang is whipping up his sugary favorites for tonight's Plate List. Before I was a chef, I was a lawyer. Uh, I was a lawyer for one year in New York City, decided it wasn't for me, and just ditched everything and went into pastry school, and my life has been different ever since. So I'm going to be making a lemon basil and lavender granita along with a honey rosemary ice cream macaroon sandwich. Let me start with the granita. Take some sugar, dissolve it in some hot water, whisk it around, make sure it dissolves. Infuse some basil and some lavender, give it a little whisk. I'm going to pour it through the strainer. I'm going to add some juice. We're just going to pour it into this container. Let it freeze for about four hours. We're going to scrape uh, every half hour to hour. I was working with really high-end stuff for many years already. And you know these desserts were really good, but people were paying like $12, $16 a plate just to get this kind of stuff. And I felt it was time that people get really good quality desserts at an affordable price, and that's where the truck idea came from. These are honey rosemary ice cream macaroon sandwiches. Honey rosemary ice cream. Just take a scoop of this stuff, place it in the middle, sandwich it together. And if that isn't luscious, I don't know what is. The very beginning for the dessert truck, it was just me and my business partner, Chris. Just me in the kitchen, like 16 hour days. Chris would drive the truck around. It's just been almost a whirlwind since night one. It's been really amazing. We've been very, very lucky. The granita is frozen. We've been scraping it periodically about every half hour to an hour, and now we got this beautiful snow. And there you have it. We have the lemon, basil, and lavender granita, and the honey rosemary ice cream macaroon sandwich. I'm going to be making a passion fruit and thyme sorbet along with a ginger snap sandwich cookie, some simmering water with some thyme that's infusing in there, or in some passion fruit puree, some sugar, a little pinch of salt, whisk it around. Now we just strain it out into my trusty ice cream container here. We're just going to freeze this for a few hours until it's hard. I've always felt like it was worth it. I mean, even if, even if that truck opened up and failed the next day, I would have had no regrets. I'm gonna make a ginger snap cookie. I'm gonna got some dough here. I'm gonna roll it out to little discs. Just cut out some little discs. Get it on a sheet pan. Sprinkle it with some sugar in the raw. I'm gonna bake it in the oven for about 20 minutes at 300 degrees. I'm about 20 million times happier as a chef than I was as a lawyer. Um, because this is what I was meant to do. I really believe that. So these cookies just came out of the oven. Now I'm going to fill them with a hazelnut and Nutella buttercream. You just flip over one of the cookies, each of these cookies, and just fill it with this beautiful silky buttercream. Sandwich them together like that. You've got a beautiful, luscious sandwich cookie now. There you go, ginger snap cookies with hazelnut and Nutella buttercream and a passion fruit time sorbet.